Ezra, you had some brilliant news this morning in that you've got your first international call-up. You're in the England under-20 squads. How does that feel? Yeah, I'm delighted. I couldn't believe it at first when a gaffer told me, but um, he, went, he took me upstairs into the office and showed me a letter, and I couldn't believe it. just can't wait to get started. When you came into training this morning, were you just expecting to come into a, a normal day's training? Yeah, normal day. Uh, I didn't expect it, this at all. I know, having spoken to the gaffer, that he said you were quite emotional when uh, he told you. I mean, what what does it mean to you being getting a call up? I wasn't emotional. I was just smiling a lot. I mean, it means everything to me, you know. It just shows that hard work really does pay off. It was, obviously we got the news, I got the news late last night. I knew a little bit before that anyway. Um, it was nice to see him this morning, just be able to, just to reward him for all his hard work. I think he's been a, an outstanding player since he's moved into the first team. He's certainly making impacts right the way through the games that he's playing in. Um, and it was uh, seeing people say it's not, people don't think they care about playing for England. To tell him this morning to see, he was almost speechless and he, he was the smile from ear to ear that it sort of told a great story and he, he deserves it. No, great news and I think it's it's well deserved, but I think it's one of those stuff for me personally, I think it's probably come later than, than what he should have done. I think maybe just because of him being a League One player and now got sort of 25, 30 games under his belt, why he's got that inclusion. But I think that he's a player that should have been probably exposed to that environment a lot sooner because he's been in and around it for the first part of the season. But no, it's even still, it's great that he's got his opportunity to now um, get his first bite of international football. It is fantastic news for, for Esri. I'm delighted for the lad. I know uh, he's also quite ecstatic about the news. It's uh, been a, a long-term ambition for him, really, because other players of his age, uh, such as Adam Ola and, uh, and Joe Gomez, was a little bit earlier, have, have got into that same age group squad. And Ezra's always thought he was good enough, uh, confident enough to say that, and he's, he's finally proven he is good enough to make that squad. Great opportunity for him now to try and prove that he's an international player. Oh.